Hi, I'm RWM, and I'm be doing the stiffness method right here. Now, I'm working out this problem right here. So the first thing you want to do is you want to look at this guy and then go, how many elements do I have? Well, we have a total of three elements here. So we would go, this represents this guy. This represents this guy. This represents this guy. Okay, so we know we have a total of three elements within our system here. So what's the next step? Well, we need to look over here. So we notice that we have a, a force one, a force two, force three, and force four. So there's four of these guys. So what does that mean? That means we're gonna have a four by four matrix. Okay, so that's how you know what this guy's gonna be. This is a four by four. So before you even work out the problem, you know the size of this guy. Okay, so what we need to do next is we need to take these guys, add it up, and then get this, right? So the first step we would do is we would start here at force one, right here. We would go here, here. That'd be here and here. Okay, then we would go here, here. That'd be here, here. Okay, then we go here, here. And if you notice here, there's no U3 here. So we're gonna put a zero into our matrix right here. Okay, so let's move on. Now we're gonna go here and here. So there's no U4 here in this guy, right? So we're gonna put a zero in our matrix right here. Okay. Now we're done with force one. So we're done with this guy. Now let's move on to force two, which is this. So this right here represents this guy, this guy, and this guy. Okay, so we're gonna start here, like I said. We're gonna add this up. We're gonna go here and here. That'd be here and here, okay? Then we're gonna go here, here. That'd be here and here, okay? Then we're gonna move on to this guy, right? This guy. And we're gonna go here, here. So that would be here and here, okay? Then we're gonna go here, here. That'd be here and here, okay? So now we move on to this next force. So we're gonna go here and here. That would be this guy and this guy. I'm sorry, this guy and this guy. And then we would go here and here, right? That would be this guy and this guy. Okay, so we've successfully added up this guy. So let's move on to force three. That is represented right here. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is go here and here. Because if you notice here, there's no U1 in this equation up here. So we're gonna put a zero here. Okay. Now the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go here and here. That would be here and here. Okay, then we're gonna go here, here. That would be here and here. Okay, then we're gonna finish out force three. We're gonna go here, here. So if you notice, there's no U4 here. So we're gonna put a zero into our matrix right here. Okay, so we are done with force three. Now let's move on to force four, which is right here. Okay, so now, first step is we go here and here. And if you notice, there's no U1 in this guy. So we're gonna put a zero in our matrix. Okay, so let's move on. So we go here and here. That would be here and here, right? And then we would go here, here and here. So that would be here and here. And you notice I skipped a step here. I This guy and this guy are next, right? In the series. Now, there's no U3 here. So, same thing here, we're gonna put a zero in right here. And then we're gonna go here, here, which would be here, here. Okay, so now we've successfully added up our global element matrix. Okay, so we're done with that. We successfully add this guy up. So what's the next step here? Well, the next step is we need to do our boundary conditions. Right here. So if you look at the problem here, you'll notice that this is fixed to a wall, so that's zero. So we put a here, we put a zero here. Okay. This right here, three, is also fixed to a wall, so that's is gonna be zero, right? And this right here is also fixed to a wall, and that's zero. 
So the reason these guys are zero is because they're fixed enemies. So that's really the first thing you need to know. And we're done with our boundary conditions.